now my first question to you what are different type of diabetes and what are the early symptoms of it so mainly diabetes are of two types uh, there are many other types but the most common ones are type 2 diabetes and type 1 diabetes uh, so out of 100 people 90 have type 2 and approximately 8 to 9 people would have type 1 diabetes uh, the 1 out of 100 would have other kinds of diabetes for example there is something called MODI which is a genetic kind of diabetes and mitochondrial diabetes and there's a special kind of diabetes which we see in countries like India it's called uh, tropical pancreatitis so uh, fibrocalcific pancreatitis and diabetes in which pancreas has some fibrosis and calcification and diabetes so for all practical purposes uh, we should know about type 2 diabetes and type 1 diabetes uh, type 2 diabetes is a slowly progressive diabetes uh, in early stages and up to a quite late stage of diabetes there are hardly any symptoms so 80 percent of people with type 2 diabetes will not feel anything so which means that uh, we will know about the disease only when it's very advanced so therefore it is recommended that we should screen for it which means that we should actively go and check for the blood glucose and not wait for the symptoms to come whereas type 1 diabetes presents dramatically with symptoms uh, which are mostly because of very high blood glucose and glucose loss in the urine so uh, it happens in younger population kids young adults uh, who present with weight loss going to the loo frequently like frequent urination, mm. excessive thirst, excessive hunger um, and if not treated then there are symptoms of ketoacidosis which is an acute complication of type 1 diabetes in which there may be uh, uh, abnormal breathing, breathlessness, kids complain that they are not feeling comfortable, abdominal pain, vomitings. Um, so these are symptoms of type 1 diabetes and because it happens in younger age people do not suspect for kids, people don't keep that suspicion open that even kids can have diabetes. So it is important to be aware of these symptoms. Uh, if any of these symptoms are present, do check for glucose. Weight loss unexplained, excessive urination, excessive thirst, excessive hunger. Uh, but in adults, don't wait for symptoms. Just go and check glucose.